I'm John Lamasby, and I'm here to talk about sharing online. I'm going to talk about my process and why it's so complicated and how you can make it a lot simpler. I share everything. I share stuff about my family. I share stuff about my life. I'm a designer. I'm a father. I'm an artist. And while I'm finding stuff out online, I make it a point to share that stuff with you. So as I find cool stuff, I try and bring it to you. The point is that you have to find it. I share it, but you finding it is kind of difficult. It's not necessarily an easy thing to do. And I do searches. I work on the desktop. I do research. I put stuff up on um, sites that end up on Google Reader. I find news stories, all of which allow me to get cool stuff that you have to find. I work very hard to make that stuff available. For example, sometimes I do video. I'm doing video right now. That video will show up on YouTube. And if you don't know where my YouTube site is, for example, there it is right there, youtube.com slash lamasby, you wouldn't necessarily be able to go and find my video. And I put a lot of video up. So I also have a beer blog. As I uh, drink a great beer, sometimes I'll make notes about it and make those notes available to you. That's at a different site. That's at beercritic.wordpress.com. And so between the video and the um, beer blog and like six other sites, you have to sort of begin to track me if you, if you really want to know all of what's going on in my life. I make my calendar available. If I, if I go into a Google Calendar and make my calendar public and you know where it is, you can go and find out where I'm going to be tonight. Tonight I'm going to be at Princeton Public Library doing Pecha Kucha. So again, I get all this cool stuff together and I put it on a whole bunch of different places, lamesting.com, beercritic.wordpress.com, lots of different sites. That's a lot of work for you. You have to be really interested in me in order to go and find all that stuff. And you probably have other things that you need to do. As delighted as I would be for you to go and start following everything that I do, it's not realistic. What would have to happen is you'd have to subscribe to my lamasty.com site, or you'd have to go into your browser and go to my Flickr site, or you'd have to go to Delicious and bookmark one of my pages, or you'd have to do a search on Lamasty, and one of these sites would come up. All of these sites would come up. Trust me, if you do a Google search on me, you'll find cool stuff that I put up. But this is the point. I want to make cool stuff that I find available to you as easily as possible. And I'm going to explain now some tools that make it easy for me to do that. Can everybody hear me? Good. So there's this thing called a Tumblr. And uh, the concept was first started by Tumblr.com. And what it does essentially is it allows me to do something like Twitter, where I can put up a quick note about myself, or I can go to a site and find something that I really want to share with you. And in like two or three clicks, I can get that content up there. Here's how it works. I'll go to a website like lamasty.com, I'll highlight something, I'll go and uh, click on a bookmark, and this little dialogue comes up. It takes the highlighted text, puts it in the dialogue, I click on create quote, and it ends up on my Tumblr. It's like two clicks, and I've put stuff up. But the really cool thing is I don't have to go through all that. I can just tell Tumblogs to go and find all my stuff according to RSS feeds. So, I put in delicious slash Lamasny RSS feed and Lamasny shared items in Google Reader RSS feed and uploads on, uh, from Lamasny on Flickr. And all these things automatically show up at crumb.tumblr.com. So instead of you going to lamasny.com, instead of you going to my Flickr site, and instead of you going to my other stuff, you can just go to crumb.tumblr.com. If you want, you can subscribe. There's the RSS feed. And it shows up. Everything from all of my different sites shows up on the site. To add to that, I found this really cool tool called Jing. The Jing project is a tool that allows you to take visual information that you see on your screen and make it very easily available to various sites, uh, one of which is Flickr and another which is screencast.com. Because my Tumblr follows those sites, it automatically publishes that stuff. 
The way it works is you have a little icon, this yellow icon up here, you roll over it, you click on the plus sign, you select a portion of the screen that you want to share, this dialog comes up, you click on <coughs> submit to Flickr, and a minute later, a few seconds later actually, it shows up there on the Flickr. In my case, whatever I put on Flickr automatically shows up in my Tumblr. So for me, it's a simplified process. I just use Jing to record something in context. So for example, I found something on Wikipedia. Instead of highlighting it and using advertise this share to, uh, share to Tumblr, I just use the Jing project to select a portion of the screen. Same thing here, I found this really cool piece of chocolate that somebody made where it shows the calories per piece of chocolate. <laughs> and I thought it was a cool thing to share. So Jing makes it really easy. I didn't have to go through any nonsense. I just did a click, hit submit, and it showed up on my blog. It's really, really easy. On May 14th, my wife's water broke. <laughs> and um, my second boy started to come into this world. And so I put it up on lamasty.com. My uh, Tumblog automatically follows lamasty.com, and so that showed up on my Tumblog. So it was more than one way for me to, to tell everybody who follows my stuff that this was going on. I wrote an email to all my friends and family uh, telling of when he was born. And I put that up on lamasty.com, it automatically got shared on a bunch of different sites because of the process that I had in place. I took photos and video of my boy, <laughs> my second boy, and put it up on lamasty.com. I can put it in a bunch of different places and it will automatically show up without me doing anything extra. And so I've taken a, a lot of different stuff and tried to make it really easy for you to get to it. Thank you very much.